So what what is it about what is it about like competition basketball that you think like bring like helps you brings you back to it over and over again? Like what is it about like competing against people? Because I know for myself personally, not now not hooping as much because there's nobody who wants to fucking hoop out here, right. and I've been truthfully I've been busy as fuck and with COVID and everything. There's yeah. no gyms and shit, so it's like uh, not as many opportunities for me to hoop. And I know it fucking sucks. Like I like miss talking mad shit to somebody or coming in people like underestimating you and like beating the fuck out of them. Right. Like I want to make you feel less of a person. That's f- fucked that's, up. It is. I want to destroy you. Every time I step on the court, even if I'm having a bad day, I'm still talking. Yeah. And, you know, and that's the thing, the competitive aspect. I'm very, very competitive. Like, yeah. I want to win. That's something when I lose, uh, you bring out the worst of me because that's when I get mad and then I want to play again and again and again. You deal with everything or just basketball because I do that shit with everything. Oh, everything. It's, it's it toxic. Doesn't matter what. It's toxic it's sometimes, dude. All that stuff. Like, get at me. Like, if you want to go at it, we can go at it, but just know I'm going to talk shit the whole time. I don't care. Oh, yeah. Winning and losing it doesn't mean anything. That's, I do the same thing. So, my girlfriend who's doing, you know, shout out to McKenna doing the back work here. Um, she uh, was like a really, really good golfer in high school. Right. Like, like when you didn't, what did you go to state ever or? No, you never went to state, but you you made it pretty far every year um, individually. Really good golfer. I golfed like twice my entire life. It's just I never had the money. It was broke, so it's like you got to have a lot of money to golf all the time. So it's um I'm not no not shitting on you. So whatever. So we if we go golfing or if we go mini golfing or anything, I'm talking the most shit of my life because I have to I have to talk shit to make it even semi fair because she's gonna destroy me and like. No one talks shit in golf because it's a fucking white person sport, and people don't do that shit. They don't Sound tolerate it. Like Tiger Woods, yeah. Um, but so it's like, even, dude, I'll be playing 2K, and like, I don't, I haven't bought a 2K in fucking years. I think my friend let me use his 2K account last year, but like, other than that, like, I haven't bought one since like 14. Oh, so cool. like, I just don't, buy, I just fucking hate that they make the same game over and over again, and it gets worse every year. And so like, I'll sit there, but I'll sit there and I don't even play the game. Like, I know I'm not as good as you if you're playing every day, yeah. right? And I'll be sitting there talking mad fucking shit. And then I'm getting, start getting my ass kicked. And, you know, I do the, the yeah, sit up. I'll be sitting, sitting up. up and I, I get to red. and it's, get but red. it's anything. We could be playing fucking like throwing bags, like fucking horseshoes, whatever it is, Mario dude. Party, bro. I'm sitting up and I'm ready. To I'm go. trying to win, dude. Yeah. I'm trying to talk that shit. Right. I, but what, what do you think it, why, why do you think you do that? Cause I, I, I think I it's like know. it's just kind of just like something that you pick up. It's an itch that you get once, mm-hmm. once you start competing a lot more, and as you get older, you learn it from other people. Like yeah, like even so, like if you're like out on the court and you've never heard anyone shit talk to you, and they're like in your ear, you're like, oh shit, this is really getting to my head. Like yeah, wow, I'm really suck right now. Like yeah, you know, and that's what I took it from. I took that from people talking to me in basketball and on the football field and all that stuff. And I just take it into everything, anything what's, competitive. What's the most disrespectful shit somebody's ever said to you? Oh, that's okay. I don't care. I'm going to shout the shout out Waterford. And I'm going to say Waterford. Hey. <laughs> so, um, uh, actually, I was at the Waterford. And this is two years in a row. I'm going to tell you what happened the first year, okay? So I was at the free throw line, you know, just doing my little routine. Mm-hmm. You know, they all started scratching and, you know, doing little monkey chants. Yeah. What? No lie. Monkey chants, man. No lie, and I'm just sitting there, you know, I'm doing my free throw. I'm just letting it go, like, cause you know I'm focused. I'm at, I'm, I'm doing my thing, whatever. So I let it slide the first year. I was like, all right, I'm gonna just let someone know, and someone's gonna figure it out. Yeah, yeah. So then the next year, the same exact thing happens, same exact thing. So you know, I was like, fuck this, I'm going to tell somebody. I went and told somebody, and I didn't get anything, but not even a letter, not an email, anything. No apology, nothing. Dude, holy fuck! Our athletic director. <laughs> Our athletic director, and I don't even, you know, I think back when I was in high school, I don't, I'm not going to comment on anything else, but I know he would have fucking handled that at least. Quick. That's fucking disgusting. It's horrible. Like, they should truly be, like, ashamed of that. That's, yeah. that fucking sound like a boomer thing to say. Yeah. They should shame but on they, you. But they really should have been shitted on for that. Like, yeah, know, that's uh, fucking, no, that's it's, terrible. It's that's horrible. like, did you, it was like a few years back when Elkhorn was like chanting out phone chan- numbers and addresses and, and they were doing like build they the were build a wall yep. to Delvin mm-hmm. and shit yep. that's just fucked up bad. and for people that don't know because I know we have people that don't obviously know these schools that listen um, Delvin has uh, a lot they have a high like Latino yeah. Yeah. and like Mexican American yeah. um, population in that school and their soccer team was fucking really talented Very and talented. I played soccer I got my ass beat by those guys like they're fucking good and so they was talking mad shit. They were chanting build a wall at a yeah. soccer game. Yeah, it's terrible. Fuck y'all. Yeah, fuck you guys. And, and I don't know how these athletic directors let this shit slide. Like, bro, we, what did we, what did, what did we chant in a student section and our athletic director was freaking out. Or we won, uh, 
our, our, our girls team like won um like the regional like every single year and yeah. like one i think it was like really close this one game and it may have been like the next round or something whatever they were gonna fucking win and we were like we're gonna rush the court he could see us all like getting hyped to like rush the court he's like no 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 whatever whatever and like same thing like we would fucking like you you would say somebody's number like like so and so your shoes untied he'd be like hey you want to be out of here you want to be out of here i want like you will never come to a game again are you, Are you kidding me? I'm like, that how is this water for fucking dropping? They just that's whack it, as fuck, dude. It. And, and and it was the same thing with Elkhorn, but I kind of made it known in Elkhorn because I knew I made it known in Elkhorn, even to this certain set of twins. But we're not gonna get into that. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah, 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 dude. But even <laughs> then, I made it known. Like I, I literally looked their student section dead in their face. I said, if you do something stupid. Just know that it's it's going to be known. Just know that I will stop. I will shut this shit down right now. Yeah, like, I'll shut it all down. Yeah, and like we can we can talk about it. Just just so they knew because I knew about their history. Like yeah, shouting out people's addresses and phone numbers like that's way too far. That needs to be taken care of right there. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So like, I don't know. I just and it's coming from people that talk mad shit. Like right. we love talking shit, dude. Right. Like but, call my number out and say but, whack shit about my nose. Anything, whatever, dude. Say anything that's very personal or down deep that's when it's different shit yeah. talk is different yeah so like i don't know yeah well that's just like it's just shit too like there's nothing like that is just next level to be bringing up where people live and shit like what yeah. it, like and plus two like what are these fucking people around in here gonna do like you want where, where are these people now what are you gonna do are you right. gonna, you're gonna throw a brick through my window like yeah. after the game like right. wow you're whack as fuck over right. a high school basketball game right. really right really wow that's you're sad, lame man. as fuck dude like you are corny um but yeah, dude, I, I don't know. So for I don't know what the worst thing that's been said to me has been. Um not not that bad. So I don't yeah, I don't think <laughs> I have any follow up to that. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching that last video. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more, the rest of the episode is right over here. Or if you want to check out other fun shit we do here on the channel, click right over here to subscribe. It's up to you, but uh it's pretty cool over here, so you should check it out.